Super Bowl is set. The two teams that are playing that will meet in the Super Bowl are the Eagles and the Chiefs. Congratulations to them. Now, the Eagles 49ers game, it was a crazy fucking game, man. Just everything that could go wrong for the 49ers team went wrong. You know, you see Bosa get banged up. You see them lose two quarterbacks in the middle of the game. You see just a lot of guys just deal with some injuries. And that's a very 49ers thing. They are a talented team. They have everything they need to win a Super Bowl and go far in the NFL playoffs. But, you know, it's just injuries, something. It's just very unfair and unfortunate. But for, for the Eagles, they had the best team in the NFC all year, damn near. And just to just to the people that are saying, you know, they don't they had the easiest path to the Super Bowl, all that blah, 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 whatever. They were the best team in the NFC. I think they deserve to be in the Super Bowl and take on, you know, the Chiefs and the talented teams in the AFC. So props to them. You look at this team offensively and defensively, they can do whatever they want. And the 49ers, they weren't that, you know, they, they were pretty decently good on defense in the game. But, you know, that rushing attack that the Eagles had was dominant. And come the Chiefs game, when the Eagles play the Chiefs, they're going to be in a lot of trouble, man. I, I think the Eagles might give the Chiefs fits. But chiefs Bengals game, I think that was an interesting game. It was a game we deserved. It was a really good game. Officiating got in the way of it. But a lot of things didn't go their way. The Bengals, speaking on them. But really, you know, Mahomes is inevitable, you know. All the talk. And I was somebody that said it. You know, I didn't say Burrow was better than Patrick Mahomes. But I said... Given if he beats him in this game, he goes to the Super Bowl, wins the Super Bowl, that resume gets a little closer. But Mahomes, just what he's been able to do in the five years he's playing, it's just been, it's just been great to watch. He's definitely looking like he's going to be the greatest to ever do it when it's all said and done. But props to Joe Burrow and the Bengals, you know. And I mean, some people needed to get humbled. Eli Apple needed to get humbled. And tough break for Joseph Asai, man. Damn, like people are at his head, but like, you know, you got to think this is a human being that made a mi mistake in the game. So, you know, cool down on that, you know, and see, he played very well in the game. Other than that mistake, he was one of the reasons, you know, they had a shot to win the game. So he has a talented future ahead of him. He, ha he has a great future ahead of him. But Bengals, Chiefs, this is going to be a matchup we will see in AFC championships down the road, five years, two years, next year maybe. So these matchups that we saw in this championship week, the Eagles, 49ers, you know, those teams are going to be back there. The 49ers, they're going to be back there next year, you know, for sure. I, I, I feel very confident in that no matter who the fuck their quarterback is, it may be Tom Brady now, you know, now that they have so many injuries that they deal with at the quarterback position and they need somebody that is going to be available in that moment. But I'm excited to see what happens in the off season for this team, the 49ers, you know, dealing with Tom Brady, Brock Purdy, Trey Lance, all, all the stuff they got to deal with. But two black quarterbacks going against each other, first time in NFL history. So that is very huge. Jalen Hurts, I'm riding with the Eagles in this game. Jalen Hurts is going to do some damage in this game. Hopefully, you know, with the run game that they were able to do, Kent Gainwell, defensively, Hassan Reddick, all the monsters they got. This Eagles team is stacked, and I'm excited to see them go against the greatest quarterback in NFL history, possibly, when it's all said and done, like I mentioned. But it should be a great game. Rihanna's performing at halftime, so it's, it's going to be a banger. But uh, it is interesting, though. Say Jalen Hurts wins this game, wins the Super Bowl, where does he rank among quarterbacks in the league? It's going to be interesting. Does he, you know, pass up Josh Allen? Does he get in that rankings? Because Super Bowl win, that changes some things. That That's a huge add to your resume, but it should be interesting to see what happens with that Super Bowl. You know, Patrick Mahomes, if he gets another Super Bowl, damn, you, you know, he's up there on the list of all time, not just quarterbacks in the league right now. But we're going to drop an episode for you guys on Tuesday. Check it out. Peace. Jalen Hurts, get back to him. Is he the best quarterback in the NFC, you think? I mean, with Rodgers possibly going to the AFC? No question. Brady going to the AFC?